to all our televiewers out there watching in this program, the special program in sports curriculum in Davao de Oro. Welcome po and have a great day. I'm pretty sure that the importance of curriculum has been discussed by the previous specialist. It is for the sake of our young, skillful, aspiring athletes or students with a special inclination to different sports events. But it does not only end up to this because this program also developed the areas of leadership and good sportsmanship. Previously, different grade level sports specialists talk specific sports. Although, all events offered in school who offered the PS curriculum. This time, allow us to talk with you the PS athletics event for the grade 10 level. But, we have to refresh first what are the usual topics we have for the grades 7, 8, and 9. During the grade 7, we discuss what athletics is, its historical background as to what it is all about, when, where, and how it was started and came here in our country. They are able to enumerate the different events in sports since it is composed of running, jumping, and throwing events or the track and field events. Identify the facilities and equipment used in the game. They're able to explore the different events by performing it or executing its specific skills involved in the game. They give the importance of warm-up and cool-down exercises to avoid injuries before engaging on the different activities for the rest of the training period. We let also know our athletes the benefits of jogging since this is the very basic skills in running, jumping, and even in throwing events. And improve one skill performance and enjoyment while they are still in this level. We consider this level as exploratory period since our athletes are trying to hop and play from one sport to another sports. As they reach to grade 8, first and foremost, review in the past lesson done to let them refresh the learning they gain and see how far they learned about the event they enrolled. This time, they have to start focus on their chosen event after such hopping from one event to another. At least, this time, athletes will stay on what event they love most. Then, focus in training, training that would help athletes get healthier and stronger with all those components of physical fitness in order to develop their skills in higher level of performance. And ready the different levels of competition although some of them are already advanced in terms of training during their elementary years. By exposing athletes to the different competitions not only in these sports, of course, it will help improve or boost the level of confidence. The usual nervousness or uneasy behavior of athletes, especially during the game, will lessen and performance level will improve. They learn to be more systematic in utilizing the time allotted every afternoon during the PS time. They are becoming independent and they have that training focused. Training without asking to do so or having training without the presence of the coach was observed. As skills develop, 
performance level also improve to what is expected and higher level of confidence acquired. As they are much exposed in the field to the different competitions, whether the school or outside the school competitions. As they build an impressive personal identity. Here comes the grade 10 level wherein past has been part and being tackled to refresh their minds as to how, what, when, and where the game started and how they started being the athletes of this athletics event. They now serve as model athletes to their fellow athletes who are younger than them. Prior knowledge on the game applied and trainings to continue even this pandemic time. Also in this level, athletes are taught and given an activities in line in this event to show and enhance their skills in sports officiating. At the same time, they formulate understanding with regards to the benefits of such activities to their fitness and well-being. As they continue, go on and overcome the challenges given, they will learn that together, sports officiating activities will be more fun and exciting without knowing that they are at the same time improving their fitness and sense of responsibility and commitment. Now, what is officiating? Allow me to define it first. Officiating, an important part of sports activity, whether it is competitive or recreational, it helps in making the activity more challenging and fun. They are able to discuss the important aspects of being an official of the game or a technical official of the game. With a fair treatment of the athletes, provision of the safe competition, or keeping the competition safe and sound. Correct application of the rules and Understanding the need of the athlete, considering their personal necessities, especially during the game. The qualities of good technical official also introduced to them. Note that the role of the official is very crucial in a sporting endeavor. He defines the success or failure of a certain activity. So, it is therefore important for an aspiring officiating official to possess different good qualities to meet the goal of having a satisfying, complaint-free, and successful game considering the physical, the emotional, the mental, and social qualities. To specify it, we have here, an official must have interest of the game, knowledgeable, with ability, common sense, work as a team, concentration, quick reaction, understand the needs of the athletes, and have a sense of humor. I'm sure athletes have this because it is their field of sports. Also, an official of the game, one must know his or her role, like being a tournament manager, for example. He should ensure that the track is correctly measured and have checked the equipment. Chief judge, able to manage the game and has the ability to set up, have thorough knowledge of the rules and able to control the area. As a referee, he or she knows how to judge what are the violations of the event and where to stay, be it a timekeeper or a lane man. And as a recorder or secretariat, he check all the finals, declare, present all the results of the game. Lastly, guidelines based on international 
Amateur Athletics Federation or the IAAF and ground rules that are suited to the local conditions are introduced to them in order for them to be equipped and ready to officiate and asked to facilitate the game. That's all the topic that we could share to you this day and hope that you learn something from what we have shared this day through this program. And this is what we always inculcate to the mind of our athletes. A healthy athlete serves as an official, maintain, and lives a healthy lifestyle. God bless, have a great day, and keep safe everyone. Again, I am your teacher, Venus Dango Catalia from Maragusan National High School, Maragusan West District. Saying, dito sa TV Escuela, sa pag-aaral, sama-sama. Bye-bye!